Welcome to Book Talk. I'm Winston. I like to read good books, and I want you to read good books, too. Today we are talking about a game from the drive Through RPG, Pocket Quest 2023 Game Design Jam. The theme was space, and today's game is All Starships Are Go! And if that doesn't put you right in the mood to play something like this, I, I don't know what does. So this is a uh, short little dude. It's only uh, seven pages. First one's cover, one's character sheets. We've got five pages and uh, basic rules. The premise is that uh, All Starships Are Go is inspired by Saturday morning cartoons and science fiction adventures. In this game, you play as a starship in a fleet made up of your fellow players embarking on a quest across the cosmos. Excellent. All right, one player plays the, the game master, home base, and sends uh, you guys out. You have your basic stat check uh, system here, not too um, different from a D20 system. Easy to understand. Um, your key resource here is juice, which serves not only as a function of health, but also as uh, a way for you to fuel your abilities. Uh, you, and then you have the different actions that you can make. You can do things like calling for, uh, you can request backup from one of your ships, allowing somebody else in the fleet to spend their action to make your stuff more successful. There's a basic combat section in here, a basic way to repair damage, and um, some basic advice on ending a play session. And then you create your characters, you've got your basic stats. There's no skills, but you do get uh, an upgrade. Choose one of the upgrades from here. And uh, then there's a way to improve your, check out the character sheet, improve your character if you want to play in multiple game sessions. And then there's a little bit of advice on building the expedition. Uh, you set out a prime directive, um, which is the ultimate goal, an encounter, something that the uh, starships are going to interact with, and a complication, something that makes them more complicated. And then finally, we have an example, Expedition. I was really looking forward to this. Good guys finish last. Expedition overview on a routine patrol of the Glup Prime Sector, the scouting ship from the Galactic Organization of Off-World Defense, G-O-O-D, did not return to home base. All attempts to contact them have been unsuccessful. Go find out what's going on. Go to the Blazeway system, and uh, you quickly discover that they lost their ship in an asteroid race, and you, yes, you, have to win it back. Marshal your team, jump in, sign up for the asteroid, wait, all asteroid race, and prepare. Stand by to raise ship. Uh, there's That's the prime directive. There's an encounter. There is... Uh, the encounters the asteroid asteroid belt race which you're supposed to run and then the complication also entering the asteroid belt race is a ship from the blasphemous adversary division bad a faction of galactic supervillains bent on taking over the galaxy 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 so your job is to win back the good and defeat the bad and uh do it for you're allowed two three minute breaks for commercials and cereal and uh, then jump back in and get it done. It's got that Saturday morning feel. There's two pages less left. Let's look at the rest of the adventure. There's no more adventure. Starter upgrades instead, which is cool. Um, you want these when making a character, but I had really wanted to see that race adventure fleshed out a bit. That's all right. For, uh, for what it is, all starships are go light short it's got that flavor i'm going to be looking at this one every now and then just for a chuckle and a bit of amusement um and who knows maybe you will too so check it out there's going to be a link in the uh a link in the comments below so you can find this on drive through rpg while you're there check out opposing forces head over to drive through fiction check out the starman books and you might even find my entry in the game design jam scrappers um when you're done there, come back here, stand by, because there's more book talk to come.